Peace, y'all. What it was, is, and will be. You know who it is. You know where you at. It's the Hip Hop Sunbet Urban Monk in the temple. Your favorite influences, favorite influence. And if you want to join me here, all you got to do is hit that subscribe button, man. Like, unlike, leave a comment, but hit that button. Become a part of the family. You become a subscriber. You become a monk. And if you have any requests, suggestions, or information regarding any of the groups that we review here, all you got to do is hit us up at Temple of the Monk at gmail.com. That's Monk with the Q. Temple of the Monk at gmail.com. Don't forget the Q and don't forget to sign up for the Discord, man. Go in there, make yourself a profile, join the live listening parties and live discussions. And if you would like to support your boy in any way other than subscribing, we have a Patreon link up there as well. We're about to dig deep right now, man. Rich Brian, 88 Rising. This, this company, I believe it's a company. This company is probably one of the dopest, man, that I've seen, but I never just, I never got to react to them. And I've, I made a list for them. Rich Brian was on that list. So we're going to go ahead and get that started. We're finishing off Hip Hop Month. But you know what? I mean, why just August, right? Why just August? I mean, hip hop should be celebrated every month. So y'all ain't got to worry. There's no time limit here. We're just going to keep doing it. We're going to keep going. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's do it. Is this the same dude that did Rich Chigga? Because that I'm I'm confused. I think I think this is Rich Chigga. He looks just like the dude. Um, the same dude that did Rich Chigga. Of course, people people made a stink about that. Like, yo, he. Let me tell y'all something, man. I just saw, and I, I'm I'm gonna cut. The, I need to cut into this real quick with that, because a lot of the stuff that we have here is multicultural. We got a lot of we got a lot of Asian culture in here, Korean, Indonesian, Japanese, um, <clears throat> Chinese. You guys see it all here. That's what I grew up around. That's what everybody I knew grew up around. Spanish, Harlem, Bronx, Brooklyn. When the Chinese flicks came on, we was there. We go to Chinatown, we buy stuff, we was up in there. No problems. But it, it's it's really bugged out, man, because and you know what? I'm going to say, never mind. I'm going to save that for another time. But I just think like the whole thing with the Rich Chigga joint, when people got upset because they said, well, it's like he's saying nigga, but he's saying Chinese nigga. Like, da, da, da. I, you guys know, you already know where I stand with that. Right. As, as, as far as black folk and them claiming that word to be ours, like a bunch of like a bunch of morons. You know what I mean? And then getting mad at other people for saying it when it's not a word you invented. A white man made that word and gave it to black people as a form, as a way to de to demean us. And then you call it turning it around and making it a term of endearment. And then, you know, when other people say it, you get upset. That's the, it's the stupidest logic behind. And, and I don't care who feels that way. It's the dumbest logic you can come up with. The dumbest. And yet I seen a joint recently with Migos who, who basically said they'd be up in China with the chinks, but they don't want China Mac or um, who is it? They don't want China Mac or not Pilo. Who is that other cat? Um, he's from, I, I believe he's Vietnamese or Thai up in Los Angeles. He's actually part of the, the Asian Crip gang out there in Long Beach surrounded by brothers saying the n-word 
and people are like, yo, he shouldn't be saying that. But there's he's in a Crip gang <laughs> in Los Angeles, and the brothers are giving him the okay pass on it. So I tell you what, you don't want him to say it, you go down there to Long Beach and tell him he can't say it. Point blank. Shut the shut the F up and just do do you. Stop worrying about all that other stuff. Because if you want to really get down with the N-word and who should say it or who shouldn't, come talk to me. And then we'll talk about who should say it and who shouldn't. But other than that, if you gonna say it, they gonna say it. You gonna rap about it, they gonna rap about it. So if you don't want to say it, stop fucking rapping about it and stop telling them to not rap about it. And if you don't want them to rap about it, then stop fucking rapping about it. Anyway, <laughs> so it, sorry, I had to go up into that real quick. Big speech. Anyway, Rich Brian, uh, I, I thought he I thought he was a funny cat, man. I thought he was a funny cat, but I only had heard the one joint from him. And that was way back. So this is going to be something different. I got you up in my dreams, but I'm all stuck in the reality. That you never really felt the same. It's more like you were using me. And I'm sorry, I didn't apologize. I got you up. Jackson Wang in the video like that. Ar Ar yeah, I don't know how Army feels about that. That's funny though. <laughs> I don't know how Army's gonna feel about that. If Ar if you guys Army in the temple, you never seen that. I'm sorry, I didn't know that was in there. <laughs> but it's just like, who? What is it? The do with it. At least he threw him up in there on beat though. Sounds familiar. They got this fool on the green screen with no visuals. <laughs> Is she real or am I dreaming? I cannot bottle these feelings now. I can't fight it all. I get chills when you leave my body. I get chills when you leave my body. I get chills. Second to see if I'm gonna vibe with her. She said, When you gonna finish? I said, In like five minutes. She's an independent type. She never need a guy with her. Never mind in my business. She might rather die with her. Stepping on the goose right now. Feeling sad and aroused. So you taking off your mask when nobody's around, girl. You ain't gotta do that shit around me. I'm a gentleman who spend a lot of time around freaks. So this fake facade just made some possibilities for us to love without no liabilities. I'm proud to say you came in here to save me. Had a scope, but don't know where I'm aiming. Do you see the smile up on my motherfucking face? I don't care what any other motherfucker say. Look Around and I don't see a hand over help. So I'm looking at the mirror saying, Look at what you made me.
That's that's a very bizarre video, dude. That is a very bizarre video. Like, uh, like <laughs> they got EJ. I, I guess that, that's how you say it. They got EJ. They got EJ on there. Green screen. No visuals on there. Like it's a, it's it's actually it's dope because it's like okay, well let's it, it's like well, let's see what it looks like without all the fancy your know, abstract video behind it and you know um it's weird because when i look at that i for some reason i was thinking about lord of the rings and the making of it and how they did Gollum, and how the people said it was weird because they had this dude the the, the voice of Gollum, the dude who does the voice is actually the character so they got him you know trotting around in this green screen outfit and the car you know all all the uh, other cast is like it's weird, you know, <laughs> having this dude do that. So it must be weird having to do that green screen like that. But other than that, it was funny. I don't know. I don't know what the I don't know what to say about some of the stuff with like Jackson Wang and the BTS joint and and all that. I don't know what to think. Um, but I thought it was funny, man. I think he's a dope rapper. Uh, I I definitely gotta check out some more. I got I got a bunch of rich jo rich Brian joints. I gotta check out, man. A bunch, but I definitely had to look at this. Okay, in any case, man. As I'm drinking Pepsi, you know, I don't know if I should cover. I don't know if I should drink it. How they drink it, like on the on the commercials where they show you. Is that how it works? Do I get endorsements for that? Probably not. Anyway, um, y'all know, <laughs> y'all know what's going down, man. Subscribe, like, share, leave your comments below, man. Let's grow together, share knowledge, and build community. Until the next time, I see y'all later. Peace. Spot, getting plenty props cause I'm weak Cali any hot till my body rides and running up I spray them down like the body shop finger bangs just with four fingers like karate chop I'm bragging more than you imagine to the non-factors and sagging cause we still getting spelling everything backwards sometimes I forget lines like gold-plated actors so I guzzle a 50 act till I regurgitate